Thank you. When we think of stars, we probably think of tiny shining objects in the night sky. At least, that's how we see them from down here on Earth. But you see, stars are anything but small. In fact, one of the largest stars, Betelgeuse, happens to be much larger than our sun. For years, this star has baffled scientists. However, recently, something more unsettling has been happening with Betelgeuse that's making scientists and other well-informed folks very concerned. Join us in this video as we explore the terrifying details about Betelgeuse's imminent destruction, as predicted by the James Webb Telescope, and how this new development will affect our galaxy and our lives right here on Earth. As described by physicist Mikio Kaku, Betelgeuse is a cosmic wonder, a giant star that has interested cosmologists for so long. A Greek astronomer named Ptolemy was the first to discover it. This star is so big that it can be seen in the night sky from Earth during winter. If you're into constellations, you've probably seen or heard of this star. It is the reddish-orange star that marks the upper left shoulder of the Orion constellation. So you see, this star is ancient, and to date, it is one of the brightest stars in the night sky. But one thing about Betelgeuse's brightness is that it doesn't stay constant. Instead, it fluctuates. This fluctuation is one of the unique properties of this star, but it isn't the only one. Let's see some of Betelgeuse's unique properties. Most of the stars you see in the night sky are actually far from the Earth. The closest star is 4.2 light years away from Earth. If you don't understand how the term light years explains distance, picture it this way. Imagine moving at the speed of light for a whole year. It's been proven that light can cover a distance of 186,000 miles per second. Hence, the distance light can cover in a year is equivalent to one light year. If you do the math, you'll have billions of miles. So when we say the closest star is four light years away, it means it's billions of miles away from Earth. But guess what? Some stars are even farther, and Betelgeuse is one of them. Betelgeuse is located about 600 light years away from Earth. So, if you were to go to a traveling at the speed of light, it still takes 600 years. We can't move that fast, not even our fastest spacecraft can. But yet, this star can still shine so bright in our sky. If you're wondering how Betelgeuse can be so bright despite the distance, that's because of its other qualities like size and brightness. Betelgeuse is about 500 times bigger than our sun. Its radius is believed to be about 1,000 times that of the sun. It is so large that it appears as a disk in space when using sophisticated telescopes, whereas other stars appear as little points of light. The disk appearance is suspected to be an effect of the reactions on the outer layers of its atmosphere. In terms of mass, Betelgeuse measures about 12 to 19 solar masses. Solar mass is the standard unit of mass used by astronomers. One solar mass is equivalent to 2 is 10 carat 30 kilograms. Scientists cannot determine the exact mass of Betelgeuse because there are no other planetary bodies orbiting around it to compare it with. And of course, we can't measure it directly from here on Earth. But it's confirmed that this star is at least 12 times heavier than our Sun. The brightness of Betelgeuse ranges from magnitude plus zero to plus 1.6. In more familiar terms, Betelgeuse is 16,000 times brighter than our Sun. Betelgeuse, also known as the Red Giant, is much brighter than our Sun. However, its brightness fluctuates due to its pulsations. When it expands, it gets brighter, but when it contracts, it dims. This process can occur for 10 to 100 days or more. One unique property of Betelgeuse is the presence of dark magnetic spots on its surface. These spots have a stronger magnetic field than the regular surface, which inhibits the flow of hot gas and makes the star cooler in those regions. Compared to our sun, Betelgeuse has more of these spots, which helps explain why it's cooler despite its size and brightness. Betelgeuse also has a magnetic field that is a thousand times stronger than that of the sun. The gases on its surface appear to be in loops or arcs when viewed through a telescope. The star has a surface temperature of about 3,500 Kelvin, which contributes to its low energy emission and dim red color. Betelgeuse was not always red. It was yellowish around 2 million years ago. Over time, its color changed to orange red, and about 2,000 years ago, it became the red star we know today. This indicates that the star is getting old. 
Betelgeuse emits 7,500 times more energy than the sun, but can still be seen with the naked eye due to its distance. However, if it replaced the sun, it would engulf or displace Earth and the nearby planets due to its size. Additionally, it emits more radiation than the sun, making it unsuitable as a replacement. Betelgeuse serves as a distant giant red star that we can study from afar. Its red light appears more pronounced because of the distance from Earth and the universe's expansion. Betelgeuse is an old star nearing the end of its life. It is dying at an accelerated rate, indicated by its irregular pulsations and dimming. Supernovas release a massive amount of energy and create heavy elements. Betelgeuse is expected to undergo a type II supernova, which could be highly destructive. The radiation, shockwave, and alteration of DNA from a supernova could have severe consequences for Earth. Observing a supernova up close is not advisable, as it can result in devastation. Previous mass extinctions have been linked to supernovas. It is essential to recognize that the high energy and radiation from a supernova can be lethal, unlike the transformations depicted in movies. Some theorists suggest that humans may only survive a radiation blast by living underground, as the Earth's crust can absorb such radiation. However, scientists and cosmologists argue that we are likely safe from Betelgeuse's supernova due to its distance. However, science continually uncovers new information and challenges our understanding of the universe. Recent discoveries, such as the detection of six massive galaxies, similar in size to our Milky Way, have made scientists reassess what they thought they knew. While some scientists believe we are at a safe distance from Betelgeuse's supernova, uncertainties remain. It reminds us that there is much we have yet to learn about the universe and raises questions about the accuracy of the information we have been given. Betelgeuse is a star that we have been able to study with the latest inventions, like the JJUST. It has unique abilities, such as pulsations. The particles from its explosion could reach Earth, potentially causing effects. It may also trigger the eruption of another nearby star, like Capella. If we are safe from the blast, we would experience light effects from the explosion. The resulting light would be visible worldwide, potentially shining brighter than the moon for a few months before fading away. After the explosion, Betelgeuse may leave behind a black hole or a diffuse patch of faint light. The timing of the explosion is uncertain, but it could happen within the next hundred years or even sooner. We must remain attentive and prepared for the possibility of Betelgeuse's supernova.